This is Yorvan, proud and mighty, shaped and hewn by Fay of old. If you hear us, then we are sleeping still. But be strong of heart, new one. Our powers are old, but our triumphs are eternal. We have brought peace to the Webwood and the forests of summer. Corruption and decay and filth were grown, were spread like sickness from the fens and dells of this place. They were led not by a beast, not by a fell one, but by her, the one who walks alone, the mother of a hundred thousand spiders. She is a queen of web and poison. She calls herself the Widow. The canopy stretched far and blocked the light of summer, but we pressed on and forward to Cathras, to the widow's den. We were but weak when we arrived, but she was weaker still, her children having died before our march. To Ashara we commended her, and then we felt the call of winter, and so some turned to sleep, and I kept watch.
Some colder wind of winter blows then, we have seen. Summer does not return our brothers, our clans to us. What will happen to the vigil I keep? Winter already calls me, and no relief is in sight. Widow walks. I can feel the heart of the webwood pulsing with her anger. Her spiders are at the gates. We never thought this day would come. The widow walks. The widow walks. That someone tripping about my web, and I thought my fun was over.
Another stirs in Yolven? But it is only a wretched mortal from that doomed town, no doubt. I'm sure my Cathras brood would love feeding on one as strong as you. The lost of Yolven is dead. Your little town is next. Tell them the widow has returned, and she is claiming what was once hers.
By the seas, you sure took the long route to Castle Yolven. Now tell me, have you found their secret? Can you stop the spiders? We can't defend the town at this rate, and we don't have the time to destroy the bridges leading to the webwood. I doubt that would work in any case. I'm going to take the survivors and barricade the inn. We'll stand a better chance of survival if we do. The widow is... I don't know. I fought in wars, I've, I've fought in duels, in bars, but never against something I couldn't beat. Never against something like her. The widow is sending the whole damn forest at us. I'm going to stay and defend the townsfolk. I need you to go in there and try to stop this. I didn't want to think the stories were true, but I've seen her hand in this since it began. It's only a matter of hours before Kenarok is destroyed, but Cathros is deep within the webwood. I wouldn't be surprised if the hollow is where she makes her home. I had hoped for an army to assist Kenarok. You're all I have. Don't know if it's fate or luck, but there's no time. The others and I will take refuge in the inn. I need to help this yes, stranger. Garner or Barton? I don't know which one would have led us out of this alive, of those of us that are still around. All I know is I need to close up the windows, check the cellar, and pray the spiders don't find the cracks in the shingling. Keep safe. What is it? Is something wrong? Yes? I have a moment I can spare for you. I do not. I'm sorry, but I need more time to prepare them. Stay safe. Damn these spiders! Damn this wood! I've had it with being cooped up in this town! Farewell. What? Who's there? If she mentioned Cathras, then you must go to the heart of Webwood. That's where this will end. One way or another. I need to help the survivors. the one that's causing all of this coming and going through webwood as you please you're tempting the widow as you stand here you're one of us whether you like it or not marked for consumption widows spare you 
Kenarok was never a safe town, stranger. But we could sleep in a bed without worry of being dragged into the night. Do you know how it feels to sit idle? Waiting to see what some spiteful god has in store for your life and those of your loved ones? Mind the web. The mortal from Castle Yolven. How vexing is it that you escaped? Your stubbornness is yet another irritation from you mortals. But it is the way of my kind to endure. It is not a quality we share. The bulk of my horde lies within, and I am eager that you might face it. But I am not reliant upon my spiders, nor am I unreasonable. I can see you are brutal in your own form. I offer amnesty in exchange for the lives of Kanarok. Oh, I had believed for a moment that you had some potential. Oh well, I lack the sympathy to kill you personally. You shall feed my guardian spiders after all. While they draw breath, none shall approach me. These walls obey my wishes. These spiders' lives are mine. Your way to me will be barred by root and fang.
And here you are yet again. I must say your hunger is great, unlike the fey I slaughtered at Castle Yolven. Now come, let us test ourselves against each other. I do not fear being cut down. I will rise again in time, unlike you. Come <laughs> on. 
Is something wrong? You've done it. We owe you our lives. And our livelihood. If not, we'd be food for spiders. And the widow would be dancing on our remains. There is not enough gold to show our gratefulness. But this is what we can give. Take it. With our thanks. I'm not much for leading towns, but I can protect it. Especially with hope like yours. Thanks again, friend. The spiders have stopped their attacks, and the wood seems a bit brighter. We'll see how long it stays that way. Be well. Oh, thank the gods we've finished with it. I can feel the veil of webwood lifting again. For the longest time, I thought I would put it behind me, try to pick up the pieces and keep heading west, from the war, from everything. But it can't be escaped. There's some things in this world you can't run from. So I decided to stay here. Safe journey. Yes? I have a moment I can spare for you. I do not. I'm sorry, but I need more time to prepare them. It's quieter than I've heard in all my years. In some ways, it's as disconcerting as knowing the spiders were still out there. Aside from your doings, I have the feeling that there won't be any more tales to tell of Webwood. Good day. Can't stop now. Thank you for your help with everything, but with half a town to rebuild, I have even less time than before. It's good to keep working. It reminds me that I'm still alive, that you saved us. I'm glad you were here and able to set it right again. It seemed like the forest itself was coming to destroy Canarok. Keep safe. Come for January. What's needed? I never thought I'd still be standing when the attacks were over. Thank you, stranger. But all that was destroyed. All the people who died. I can only thank the gods Siloretta was spared. Damn these fey and damn their magic. We lost half a dozen because some bloody witch thought to be nice to her pet spiders? You've killed one, and that's a start. If I had my way, I'd burn this whole forest to the ground for what they did. Yeah, what can I help you can. with? We've still a long ways ahead of us before the silken seat is back to what it was, but I've had Billis hard at work to make it so. Now, what is it that I can do for you? It's a monstrous place. When Unfer first moved us here, it seemed nice enough. We were so happy. Beware the forest! We've still a long ways ahead of us now. What is... Beware the forest. I, I... I'm sorry for being hysterical with you earlier. I... I lost a husband to those monsters before you arrived, and I was sure to lose my son. But you've saved us, Billis and I. I thank you for that. And wish I had something for your trouble. I'll give you all I can. Widows, spare you. Get out of here!